I figured I might as well start this now. I have one more shift tomorrow, and then I leave tomorrow evening to start senior year. Last night I went to go hang out with some of my friends. We were all talking, and I was like, oh, like, what's like, how's everyone's summer been, like, da da da, whatever else. And like, it was just kind of like an overall consensus of like, oh, like, it's been better. Like, we've had better ones. And like, like, the part of me feels like I wasted my last summer. Maybe this is what I'm learning right now is that like, okay, yeah, no, like, you're gonna be fucking miserable if you're just trying to plan everything out. I've just been so stressed about like what comes a year from now that I've spent so much time trying to plan it and figure I've, I've, but I've gotten nowhere I've literally gotten nowhere like I don't I don't know like, I feel like I'm behind everyone but, like maybe I'm not I don't I don't know like I don't know what life after college holds and it's scary it's sad like I'm like growing up I got so wrapped up in like the like what am I gonna do that like I wasn't enjoying right now. I feel like future movie like yelling at this version of me. Like it's almost like I'm like longing for something and I don't know what it is. Whatever. But like I'm I'm just I feel like nervous. Like I'm like holy fuck, like I'm go like this is it. Like oh my god, I'm gonna start crying and next to a subway before work. But I feel like my entire life like I've been stressed out for like what comes after college and like I've always just been really scared of like the future unknown like changes like all of that has just always been like a very big stressor for me and like what comes after college like what is it and it's like okay like there's what it's whatever you want and like that sounds so exciting yet it's so scary and now i'm crying next to a subway before i go into my like minimum wage paying job and i gotta post this on the internet for my senior project Hi. <laughs> Oh, my head just popped. All right, I'm going back to Fredericksburg. And I'm not a slave. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. By any means. Trafford still has a lot of meaning to me because I grew up there. Well, I guess it's a small, small community. Come on. Come on. People that really look out for each other. Mom hasn't done anything. And that's the same oh, she's just watched. That needs anything. It's, it's community Shout out my man, uh, Caleb, for screwing up my stick. Does it look cool? Looks super cool. Does it actually like say to the people oh. who are watching? You know, I got nothing. I got nothing. Okay, I'll figure it out when I get there. What was my yearbook put in high school? Uh, I can't remember. Oh, I'm in no rush to get there because I have no idea what I'm doing. This is actually it. This is it. Okay. Move. Come and say bye to the people. All right, Mr. Gomez, get up. What do you have to say? He's growing up. I'm gonna miss her. I'm gonna miss you. I have, I have one more thing. What? Make good choices. Make me proud. Starting tonight, who's ready to party? All right. Um, I tried to leave, but Gomez. Oh, oh! Um, Gomez ready to drive? Okay. Go pilot. You gotta go, okay? All right, I love y'all. Oh, wait, I should probably put my GPS in first. My car looks so clean. We cleaned it today. All right, let's hit the road to Fred Vegas. Oh, wow. Oh, my God. This is so. Why is the AC on? Oh my god. Wow. Look at her go. Should I like, film you guys too? I feel like this is like weird. Alright, bye. 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 Oh, is that like illegal for me to like pull off with like the camera in my hands? Here's the situation next to me. We're just hoping that they don't go flying. Just cut to dad's camera, okay? She needs new brakes, honey. She's gonna die. No, you're not gonna die. I'll see y'all in Fredericksburg. Oh, I, that, that did not come out smoothly. That's okay, though.
Love you too. Go on sound. Cause they'll let you play music real damn loud. Okay, I'm not even gonna lie, when I got in yesterday, I literally just threw everything inside and got everything up to my room. And I literally have like my entire life that I need to unpack today. God, if it were a good morning, I wouldn't have to unpack my entire room. Little nigga, you ain't built like me. I don't call her at all, but she still like me. Making the movie, they don't film like me. They don't start from I'm so done with unpacking. I can't do this anymore. Here's the current situation. Honestly, it still looks, it looked a lot better in my mind. It looks better than it did before. On camera, it still looks. Oh God. I did finish for the most part, like getting my room all set up, but here's my plant fern. Fern doesn't usually sit down here though. Fern's getting a little too big. I have a new pot. From what I understand, if you put rocks and then the soil and then the plant, like I should be fine. I don't know, fern started off in this little thing, and now Fern's in this, but I need to put away my groceries too. We have a lot of pickles, a lot, so. Maria, I would like to think that you're watching this. I got two potatoes. I've actually been cooking potatoes recently. My sophomore year, I would just let the potatoes like literally, not rot, but I would just let the potatoes sprout. So if that's not character growth, I don't know what it is. This isn't a pantry, this is literally a bookshelf with a curtain. I think he's gonna fucking hate this. I know, I know I am. So here's the setup that we got. Wow. So I don't know why they sell rocks in boxes. My biggest concern at the moment is that I'm not gonna be able to carry this upstairs to my room. There's a lot of rocks in this. It's like a kid's like ball pit, but it's gonna be covered by a plant. My mom goes through phases of wanting to be a gardener. Here's my plant. I think my favorite part of my personality is that I don't feel like I radiate plant girl energy. But I love Fern. I kind of got Fern as a joke. Not as a joke, but I was like, I want to see if I can do it. What the fuck is this? There's another shovel in here? Here's the mess. Look at that. If that's not A plus gardening, I don't know what it is. I also feel like a fake plant parent too because I really don't know what I'm doing. I literally feed my plant from the same water bottle that I drink out of. Oh God. Oh my god, I'm like actually out of breath. That was really hard. But if you see, there's Fern. I don't even know why I was drawing my backpack. Okay, bring it in. Oh god, happy first day of senior year. I would have liked to do like a cute little like get ready montage, first day of school, but like, no, I don't like to see anyone in the morning. I don't like to talk. It feels like we're back to school. All I want to do is go to sleep. I have one class. What the f- how, how do freshmen do that? Like, I'm literally reflecting back on how, like, last year I took 18 credits at this time, and my junior year, sophomore year, I had an ADM, and I'm like, I have a 12 o'clock class. It's 9.30. I already don't want to go. Let's go do all of that. It's five in the morning. More of a smile in my cup. Do you guys want to know what's wrong with America <laughs> today? Is that you can't buy chalk anywhere. It's a beautiful day in Fredericksburg. Every day I put on there when I grow up I want to be Kate. So Zoe's just left out. Yeah. To be fair, no one says they want to be me either, so. <laughs> I want to be you when I grow up. Oh my god, there's Tally trotting on over here. Tally, what do you want to be when you grow up? Aw, Tally. <laughs> Myself. Oh, so much stuff at home. Well, we're done with school for today, or well, I thought I was done with school for the day. Turns out I have a night class. I don't know. I just think like, I had the biggest like shock of my entire life though, because I really fully believe. First day done. First day done. <laughs> no, first day not done till nine o'clock tonight. Me. But yeah, so now we're walking back to Kendall's car. I didn't film anything of me doing. We did our first class. Okay. Yeah. Over the summer, I asked like the AI like chatbot. I was like, write a story about each member of One Direction fist fighting each other. This is a workout. I know. I'm so ready for this mile. I can't even walk up the stairs. Here's the theater. I've never been in there. We should go see a show. I'd like to go to one show before I graduate. Okay, which one? Oh, can we go to Matilda? Yeah. Okay, great. Where'd you park? Oh my god, Kendall, I got a new car. Cause my car died. Her car died. <laughs> Do you want to say hi? I'm vlogging. Are you excited for your first day? Um, yeah. I had two classes. This is my last class. And honestly, I'm exhausted, but... I thought I had one today. In that class, I checked banner. 
No, it's a night class. I have a six P. I know. I met, and then I sat there. Here. Basically, Kendall's taking me home. Thanks, Tommy. Just like last year. Just like last year. Woo! And now Kendall has a backup cam. I do. I don't use the. Okay, run bees. I don't know what that means, but run bees. I have so many videos of me just like driving in the car with people, like from like freshman year or whatever. Like we're gonna look like such babies. I can't believe we're so big. All right. Thank you. Bye bye. <laughs> oh, that's so low. It's the day of the mile. Kendall and I are about to go to Duncan. I think I'm gonna throw up. Here's my shirt that I'm wearing today. It's hard out here, boys, being a D3 athlete. I feel so much more content in this shirt. Kendall, I'm not kidding. <laughs> It's giving D3 lacrosse. Right? So we're going to Duncan. I hope it gives me an anxiety attack because I will run fast if I'm stressed out. Kimber told me I should just push love me out. That song makes me want to like flip a table. <laughs> she needs like some artsy shots. Yeah. To like ripped on it. <laughs> to what? <laughs> oh. <laughs> rips on it. Kendall, I pray, bedazzled pray, on the American flag, red, white, and blue baby that we passed this mile. There it is. I have vitamin C and caffeine. Oh, that rhymes. Welcome to class. No one's here yet. Oh my god. So, Kendall, don't tell them what your predicament is right now. So her mom won't respond to her text messages. Yeah, I'm getting ghosted by my mom. I've only been gone for like three days. That's where I gave a presentation. And I got told that I went too long. Get this haircut back. Oh, I don't oh, want it. <laughs> do you have any advice for the mile today? For this class, stay The mile, the mile. <laughs> stay away during your miles. Too. For the mile. It's a mindset. Mm -hmm. Girls are fast. You got it. It's Peace out. I don't know when class is starting. Hello, I'm Coach Kim. <laughs> what are we doing today? Oh, we're gonna do the mile. Yay! So, Play. Um, we're gonna do the mile. Do yeah. you have our old times? I do not. Okay, cool. That's good. <laughs> Five bucks to whoever just kicks Reagan in the shins before we start. Go ahead. Oh. Sorry, you're not actually gonna be the hitch. It's okay. I accept your part. All right, hi everyone. Hi! Today we are running our mile. Start of the, the day, not the day, the season, fall ball. Should we like, pretend to run it right now? Yeah. <laughs> Ready, Sophie? Go, go, go! I want to break the record for the mile, so I'm going to aim for 320. Okay. Um, really just bust it, falls to the wall, see how it goes. Amelia, what are you going for? Uh, low sixes. Oh, you weren't going for a 319 just to beat Reagan? She doesn't want to work. Some people don't want to work. People don't want to work these days. All right, we're mid warm-up jog What would you just call Amelia? I said Amelia never ran with headphones before, but now she is. Uh, so she's getting soft to the uh. What? This is me after my mile. Here uh -huh. got a 560. Yeah. Or no, 544, but no big deal. Yeah. Slay. What's up, guys? <laughs> just finished the mile. Right. We are speedy birds! Hi, everyone. Welcome to pickup. We're putting on our turfs right now. Can you want to talk, you, talk to a wall and put my shoes on? Hey, everyone. This is at Kimbo on a slice of, you, <laughs> slice of this coming at you live. We just finished on um, our first mile this season. Here's our birthday girl, Caitlin. Caitlin, how did you feel on your first mile? I did better than I expected, so. Awesome sauce. Reagan, how'd you do? You know, we did it. Um, I got sung by B after. Not ideal, <laughs> but. It's so you know, Reagan of you. We're here. I'm Why Sophie, I and I, I beat my goal by now. one second. Yeah! And back to your owner. Okay. We need to have a chat. Maybe by the end of the semester and the end of all this project, I will start looking through the actual lens and not just the viewfinder. My room's also just a mess. The entire thing's a mess. I'm 20 years old. I'm not supposed to have everything figured out and I know that. And like it's one of those things that like whenever I'd ask my friends like, oh like what are you like doing after you graduate? Like last year when like they were seniors, like yeah, I always like felt like kind of bad. I was like, haha, like you know what I mean? Like it can't be that bad. Now I'm here and people are asking me what I want to do with my life after I graduate. And I have no idea. Like like the entire reason I got to I'm double majoring is 
because I don't know what I want to do. This stage of life is supposed to be like, I don't know. It's just a very scary place to be of like, like, I know, like, I know I'll be fine, but like, I don't know what's happening. I don't know what I'm doing. Like my yearbook quote, my senior year of high school, um, it was from my history teacher, Mr. Burns. Shout out to Mr. Burns. I, he's not gonna watch, he's not watching this, but like, I'm in no rush to get there because I don't know what I'm doing. And like, that's exactly where I'm at. Like, I'm not in a rush to get to the end of senior year. Oh my God, I'm gonna start crying. No, it's fine, I'll keep talking, okay. I've, I've just always been scared of the unknown. Um, and like the entire point of this project is to show that like, yeah, like college is so fun and so great. And, like everything you see on Instagram is great and fun. But like this, this is behind the scenes. Like this does exist. I just did not think that like we'd be getting this like, ugh, like I'd be like crying on camera the first day. But the concept of like, now it's like, okay, like it's whatever you want. Like that's terrifying. And also how do you make friends in the real world? How do you do that? Because like, I love my friends here. Like they're great. Like I never want to lose my friends here. But I just, I don't know how you like do that. Like I know that's like something like I'm not gonna ever really know how to do until I'm there. But like, I have no idea what I'm doing with my life. The only reason I'm talking to Karen is I was gonna like turn this all around. I'm like, I have no idea what I'm doing, but like I went to the store and I bought myself flowers because I did. Look at these. They're so pretty. I bought two of them. And instead I just was like, fuck, I don't know what I'm doing with my life. And like, I know I'll be fine. And like, I know I'll be okay. It just seems really lonely. My initial plan um, within all of this was for me to bring up how I went to the pharmacy and like I was forced to like sit down and stop. Cause like, I am a very go, go, go person and I think my biggest fear for this year is that me not knowing what comes next is going to hold me back from enjoying right now. I, I want to waste time this year. I want to do stupid shit. I, I want to have stuff to look back at. Maybe I'll put this here for like future me to watch. Like, yeah, you have no fucking clue what you're doing. You don't. Like my walls here are like entirely like covered and like quotes and like positive messages and everything. Like it's impossible for me to like be negative in this room. Cause even when I sit here and I'm like, am in a bad mood, like I'm still laughing at it and I know it's true and I know at some point it'll click. I'm, I'm happy that even within all the chaos and within me not knowing what I'm doing, I'm here. This is probably going to be a more serious series of videos. Like this is probably not going, and who knows, maybe I'll have a fucking meme like inserted right here. I don't know how I wanna edit this. I don't know how I want to tell this story because I don't even know how the story's playing out. I don't know how the story's ending and I think that's nerve wracking and exciting because I am, for the first time, I'm going to get to be the author. It feels like home here right now and I think I'm just, I don't wanna leave and I, but I also don't wanna be grasping on to the past so much that I can't enjoy right now. I don't know, like maybe this is just me learning how to do all of it. Can we stop being deep now? Cause I'm hungry, I need a snack and I need to put these in a vase, so. Come on, let's go fill this shit up with water and do all of that. I think I can use my bathroom water. I don't know why I would have to use the sink downstairs. That's not gonna fill up. Okay, we gotta go downstairs. Putting them on the floor. Like I literally keep setting them on the floor because I don't know where else to put them. I'm pretty sure you have to cut the stems of flowers. At least I always do. Camera angle change. I might have gotten too many flowers for one base. The worst part about all of this is that I have a tripod in my car, but I'm too lazy to go grab it. So instead, I just keep stacking up random things for my camera to sit on, so I can film all of this. Also, please ignore the fact that I have a stool on my dresser. I put my camera on that. I don't apologize for my door being open. Welcome to college, ladies and gentlemen. I probably should have waited to put babies right now. I always thought being a florist would be easy. I'm learning I was wrong, and I apologize. Literally, my drawers are all open, and this is getting all over my pants. That's all, there's no one I can blame but myself. I like that you can't see me. It's kind of like Charlie Brown, like when the mom's like, wah, 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 wah. Here's my flower base. It's gonna replace my school. That's not adulting. I don't know what it is. Okay, I need to like get my like life going, so goodbye. He said the sun is on the rise tomorrow. Is this so peculiar? Welcome to senior year. Then pack your bags, let's stick out your chest and then hit the road. Did you have any commentary? Oh, that's a little rough. <laughs> Don't give it a reason to follow.
like I'm watching a dystopian home. movie. Let it's just, like, be. Trekking through the desert. Then let it go. There's a lot of cool rocks here. 